Hello viewers, I hope you are well and good. You are welcome to my channel once again. Today, I would love to show you how to make these beautiful scrunchies or hair ruffle. And the materials needed is my velvet material and my elastic band. So, you can use a certain material or any other beautiful fabric you feel like using. You can use Ankara, any other material that you think it's beautiful. So, the next thing to do is to measure the length of my fabric. And I have 30 inches as the length here. 30 inches. So, the next thing is to measure the width. And the width is 5 inches. So, I have 30 by 5 inches for the fabric. And the elastic band length is 8 inches. So, I have 80 inches on the elastic band. So, right now, the next thing to do is to fold the elastic into two and join it like so. So, I'll go and join it on my machine. You can also use your hand needle to stitch that part. So, after stitching it, I'll go to my machine and place the right side on the right side as you can see. So I'm about to make my scrunchies right now. So I will stitch on half an inch. I'm going to stitch on half an inch. And the stitching will go on and on like that. It will be a straight stitch. So I'll try and adjust the elastic that is inside so that the needle will not press on it. So I'll do that gently. Then I'll go gradually I'll stitch it gradually as I'm stitching I'll be adjusting the elastic band that is inside so I'll be stitching on half an inch like I told you And after stitching it round, as you can see, so the rough edge, the two rough edges is there. But the first thing I will do is to turn the right side out. So what I'm trying to do here right now is to first of all turn the right side out. So that we can see the beauty. So the right side is out. So I'll pull everything out. So the next thing to do is to place the rough edges that I'm about to pull out now. The two rough edges, place one inside another. I'm going to tuck it inside each other. Then I will stitch it on my machine. Then I will show you the result. So I'll place it like so. Then go on the machine and stitch it neatly. And this is the result after stitching it. This is what I have. So. I have my scrunchies ready. You can also use hand needle for all this that I've used sewing machine for. If you like our video, don't hesitate to subscribe, like, and share. See you in my next video. Bye.